here with the big stun from Adelaide, Paul Slawinski, our main eventer here at Evolution Melbourne. Paul, welcome to Melbourne, brother. It's good to see you as always. We bump into each other right around the world, you and I, which means you're trying to get back into K1. To do it, though, you're going to have to put up a good showing against Ben Edwards here tonight. In the scale of your career at the moment, how important is it to beat Ben Edwards tonight? Um, I've fought him before. Um, he's, I've beaten him before. We fought before. I, you know, I stopped him then. Since then, he improved a lot, but I don't think he improved a lot to the standard where he, where he can beat me. For example, last four years, he's been fighting people like Andrew Peck and other Oceana fighters, which I knocked him out of five years ago. Uh, when I was fighting last five years, I was fighting top fighters in the world against, you know them, in K1. So I don't, yeah, he's dangerous. He's got, you know, big hands, strong hands, but, um, so did Mighty Mo, so did you know other heavy fighters I fought and um, I think I'm gonna be okay tonight. Well with uh, Bang and Ben Edwards, Ben, a big step up main eventing here tonight. Of course the international kickboxer magazine belt is on the line, so that's a, a good accolade for the winner. But taking on potentially the biggest name in Australian uh, Muay Thai in the heavyweight, super heavyweight ranks, Slawinski. Big step up, but you've knocked off some big names yourself recently. Yeah, I've been on a bit of a roll lately. I've, uh, I've, been, I've only had five weeks off training all year, so we've uh, made the best out of a bad situa situation with my trainer passing away in February, and I've uh, yeah, been on a real roll since then, so maybe there's a bit of, uh, bit of help from above, I think. Well, Slawinski, of course, uh, last time out, and he's, he takes great pride in uh, showing the highlight reel of, uh, of chopping up your legs. Yeah. But uh, he's going to change the game a little bit tonight. We're here. What have you got in store for him? Mate, if he comes out and stands with me and I don't knock him out, if he doesn't throw one kick, I'll give him one purse. And if I don't knock him out, he cannot stand with me. He knows that he'll try and chop my legs up. If he doesn't, he'll get knocked out. OK, moving on from tonight, whatever the result, what's, uh, what's in store for, for Bang & Ben Edwards going forward? Great support. I've got to say, the people from Canberra have made the journey down to Melbourne in droves, so you've got some great support. Yeah, I've got a great fan base back at home and all over Australia. There's a lot of people who get behind me and I, I can't thank them enough. It's a big effort to come down to Melbourne and I, I love it. Love it. Well, two of the best heavyweights in this country getting it on tonight. Ben, you're looking in great shape, as is the thing. So I really look forward to that main event and uh, it's going to be an honour to call it. All the best to you and Paul for that one. Thanks very much, guys. May the best man win. Okay, folks, it is the time we've all been waiting for. So much talk, so much speculation on internet message boards for this one. The International Kickboxing Magazine title on the line. In our main event is the big stud Paul Slawinski takes on the governor, Ben Edwards. Hammer, a lot of people saying it'll be Slawinski's kicks versus the sheer brute power in the hands of Benny Edwards. Well, it's going to be a, a bit of a contrast in style. I think if Slawinski fights a smart fight, he could uh, put it together. But if he stands there and trades with Ben Edwards, it could be a little bit of a flip of a coin. Too many people here have spoken to me tonight and said they just can't pick it, and neither, neither can I, to be honest with you, boys. OK, folks, here we go. One man already a star in the K1. One man looking to get there. Who will emerge triumphant in our main event? Firstly, from the blue corner, from Canberra in the ACT, this is Ben, the governor, Listen to the ovation, Ben Edwards from Canberra. You've got to look at the record here on Edwards and appreciate the power in this man's hands. 22 wins, 21 knockouts. Maybe the highest knockout ratio in the heavyweight world of kickboxing and Muay Thai. WMC World Heavyweight Champion, K1 European Champion, K1 Oceania Champion. Back in Australia after living and training with the great Ernesto Hoos for a long time over in Amsterdam. 
always dangerous, the master leg dumper, Paul Slowinski. <laughs> Official weight, 113.4 kilograms. Standing six feet two inches. Hailing from Canberra in the ACT. He's the current state Australian South Pacific champion. And a two-time, two-time world champion. Tonight, wearing silver shorts with blue trim. Referee Brian Murphy here with the final instructions. Look at the stare down from Ben Edwards. Slewinski refusing to engage. The rematch last time it was Slewinski who chopped out the legs of the governor. Can the governor get his revenge here tonight? Alan Wong in the corner. As the beautiful Kirsten Lee does the rounds here yet again. And we are ready for five by three. This place is alive and happening for Evolution 18 Melbourne, our main event. It has been the speculation of so much debate over the last few months when it was first announced. And now the time for talk is over. Edwards, the highest KO ratio perhaps in the world of any heavyweight fighter. 21 in 22 wins via KO. Slowinski, the leg thumper with the left knee heavily strapped. The voice, Michael Shavella, Mark the Hammer Castanini. Here we go. Edwards says, if he stands and trades, I'll knock him out. If I don't, I'll give him my purse. Well, a big thank you again to the Zagami family, Robert and Victor, for their support. And Caravilla Builders, Dennis, thank you so much for uh, getting behind the show. All the great sponsors uh, that have made tonight possible for Evolution Melbourne. Oh, Slowinski got tagged with a short left hook early on. Ben Edwards opening up like a house of fire. Outside fire kick, left damage lead leg. Slowinski's got to kick the legs. He cannot stand and train with the governor. Well, Slowinski uh, has a knee injury, but has uh, opted to take the fight. Such is the resolve of this man. Not uh, letting it bother him at, at all in uh, taking on the up and comer, the young line, Ben Edwards. So a tipping body shot. That was Ernesto who style from Slowinski to the liver. And now he's kicking the liver section. And in again, it. rips that liver shot in the inside fire kick. That's the Ernesto who's training hammer. He needs to be moving and he needs to have his gloves plastered to the side of his head. Oh, he Glancing wants hook. shot. Edwards on the front foot. Well, we just seen, uh, we saw in Jamaica, Slowinski take care of Patrice Quadron. 
With ease. Oh, With ease. And he knocked him out via the hands. Edwards swing with the big left hook. Michael looking for the KO as well via what he knows so well, the big looping punches. you got to wonder, though, if Edwards setting this pace, will he blow himself out if this one goes to deep water? Outside fire kick from Slowinski. And again, Slowinski going to the old bread and butter, the old nugget, the real leg round kick. Well, Slowinski being mobile, that's that's uh, good tactics from him. He didn't want to, didn't want to see him uh, getting to uh, a stand-up measure off against each other last man standing quite a exchange oh Slowinski landed the right hand and Edward just shrugged it off like a battering ram here comes the governor he can't drop his hands when no. he kicks Paul though Slowinski be wise just to rake up the scorecard keep kicking the legs here of the governor it worked for him in the past it'll work for him again jab outside thigh kick nice combination from Slowinski can't drop that right hand and he does again and gets punished. Edwards with that lethal left hook. Nice leg kick with the sting. Already that left leg has taken a lot of battering on Ben Edwards and he has slowed down. Well, Ben Edwards has to let the hands go rapid fire because once his legs get uh, corked up, it's going to slow his movement down. It's going to stop him from closing the gap and uh, unleashing with the other uh, hand flurries. Slow down his movement, therefore making his hands more predictable. Slowinski in turn needs to keep his hands up and kick. Lost his footing. Yeah. The move that... needed to be in there on that one. And we're okay to go on here. Oh. Jab two. Postman throwing some heavy artillery. End of the round. We couldn't even hear the bell because this place is electrified. Well, what a great first round brought to you by Caravilla Builders, our major sponsor here tonight. And then you see the Bush is trading the leather, trading the leather, hardcore. Slowinski, his strategy is obviously to go downstairs and still chop that leg, work what he knows so well. Edwards looking for the big finisher. Second round of action, have a look at Ben Edwards, who's already blowing heavy through his mouth. It was always going to be the question mark. Did Edwards have the stamina? Did he have the cardio to go the solid work right now? That's Lewinsky possessions. Well, Ben Edwards, the man that knocked out Popoate boxing, shows the power that he possesses in Slowinski at the upper echelon of, uh, of K1, fighting some of the biggest and best, has proven his worth time and time again. Right hand from Ben Edwards. Oh, he caught him! And Slowinski showing he's going to draw as well. I'd like to see Paul using the uh, the push kick, keeping Ben at bay. Edwards throws the overhand right, then the left hook. Nothing connecting though. Slowinski just finding range nicely, slams the outside lead by. And uh, I think that lead thigh of, uh, of Edwards is starting to uh, pump oh, the Oh, yeah. Again. Here comes again. the rubber leg. And that's, gonna, that's just going to make Slowinski grow in confidence markedly. Slowinski will smell the victory on that lead leg if he doesn't take shots like that. What are you doing, Slowinski? You've got to stay at range and just kick the lead leg. Does he not realise, Hammer, that that leg is right for the picking? I would, I would have thought he would have seen it, Michael, but uh, obviously not. Set the jab, go low, jab low, jab low. Like there that. it is. He needs the jab, though, to, to disrupt the flow of Ben's hands. I know, Paul, I know his mindset, and he's going to want to trade with hands just to prove that he can. Not always a clever tactic against the uh, fight of the Galloway. It is that Edwards. notorious Slowinski ego that sometimes gets the better of him. He should just be cracking out that lead leg. And now he goes to the inside thigh, then the outside thigh. You've got to wonder how many more clean leg kicks no, Edwards can take. He's already uh, hurting that with that lead thigh. I'll say three Michael. more, Hammer. Three more clean ones. There's one. Two more. But muscles now spasming. The blood is pumping into the injured part of that leg. That's what's happening. It's starting the spasm. It's starting to uh, to slow Edwards down, obviously. But the body is now realizing that that leg is injured, and all it's all Ben's resources, all his strength is now going into that injured thigh. And there's three. And there's three. A standing count here from the birth. Edwards held up his hand as if to say, "Whoa!" It's all I said enough. Yeah. The ball could stop this by kick KO again. Six, seven.
Edwards is going to miss his opportunity here. We'll he has to go for a Hail Mary run. shot. It's all he's got go, left. Go. He's going to go springboard and just leap and throw. Boom, shakalaka again from Slowinski. Edwards, what has he got left here? Slowinski's just going to chop out that leg. It's a sickening sight between the headline of the trunks. And Slowinski. He's oh. evil. He's evil. He's just going to line him up. There it is. Well, this is the fight that the fans wanted to see. There right. it is. Down goes Edwards. Oh. Down goes Edwards. Oh. He's not going to get up. Five, oh, six, he's going to get to his feet. The captain's on his feet. I, yeah, this oh, place rallying him on. Heart. What a hard, massive hard. Wow. From Ben and Ben Edwards. Hammer. Okay. You're a coach yourself. What do you do now? Do you throw in the towel or do you roll him back out for another round? I would tell uh, Ben if he's able to to switch stance, maybe try and fight as a southpaw. It's obviously he's not going to have the uh, the fast switch uh, muscles working for in that lead thigh so he can check. So he's either going to have to switch stance, go southpaw, and try and bomb fall. But uh, I tell you what, it's, it's not looking good for him. I don't even know if that's a possibility at this point. Slowinski relaxed in total control. And Ben Edwards is breathing heavy. That leg has got to be just killing him, Hammer. This is where Ben Edwards has to uh, try and put the pain out of his mind and go to that, that next level. I've seen it before. I've seen Edwards take inhuman punishment. And he opens up like a house of fire. He tried for a Superman punch. And he's changing his stance. Yes, he heard you, Hammer. But he needs to uh, see how comfortable he's oh, going to be. Now Slowinski's going to go to town on the right leg. Jumping back on that back leg. He is like some insane torturer. This one surely is over. One, surely two, that's it. Three, Alan four, Wong in the corner of Slowinski's saying, five, get up. We want to give six, you more punishment. Get the seven, F up. And eight, Ben Edwards is back up. What a hard from Whoa, the big fella from Canberra. What? I know he's... Uh, he's Trainer Johnny Baran, late trainer Johnny Baran will be looking down proudly on the effort that the Edwards has put in. Oh, almost. He's gone. Surely it's only another He's kick. Gone. There it is. One, two. Have you ever seen a three, beating like this? Never an evolution. Four, Have we seen a man five, take a beating? Six, if it was Mickey in his corner from seven, Rocky, he'd say, Stay down. For real life, Rocky gets back to Let me tell you, though, Michael, before this fight, Slowinski's crew was a little worried about Ben Edwards. They knew this was going to be an easy fight, but he's done the work. It's good it's all over. Faith and Paul Slowinski has put it together well, Michael. Oh, my word, Hammer. Maybe the most brutal, brutal display we have ever seen in evolution history. I have never seen a man take punishment like that and keep getting up. It threw back the memories of Mark Hunt versus Jerome LeBanner in Paris many moons ago. Well, it's up. just smiling in front of the huge Ben Edwards <laughs> contingent behind the big, us. The big Polak's happy he's done the job. Poland, Poland's Sportsman of the Year, Paul Slowinski, you know he's uh, based in Australia. The Polish uh, sporting authorities voted that man the Sportsman of the Year for the whole of Poland. You know, Hammer, I was in Poland early this year doing a K1 show, and I tell you, Slowinski is a huge figure over there. He certainly is, yes, and uh, he's now consolidated and shown why he is the number one super heavyweight in all the Oceania region. Once again, you see Slowinski just setting himself for that low kick. Edwards tried to rally, but just couldn't have it. Didn't have the conditioning in the legs, didn't have the power. Went for the big bombing hands again, but it was a game of strategy from Slowinski that told the story in the end. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Brian Murphy stops the fight. One minute and 21 seconds into the third round by TKO. And new IK Super Heavyweight Champion, the Sting Chopping out the legs yet again of Ben Edwards. So much speculation. And the international kickboxer bounce around the waist of the stand. What a night it's been here at Evolution 18, Melbourne. We've seen awesome knockouts. Thailand against Australia. And the devastating leg dumping work of Slowinski. Ben, just come over here, mate.
Mate, it was a very, very courageous fight. Obviously, he was chopping it down left and right. I felt that uh, probably over the first round, he had a lot of control. Any one of you guys could have gone down at any minute, and he had a lot of support here from a lot of five, a lot of people here as well. Yeah, I had a lot of friends come down from Canberra and some from Sydney and uh, all over the place. And the crowd was about 50-50 on my side too, so I really appreciate that as well. Thank you. Now, mate, just take us through, obviously, the first round. A lot of people felt that you had control over the fight. What actually happened in the second and, and well, we just know what happened in the third round, but what actually happened in the second round with Paul taking a little bit more of control? Yeah, mate, he chopped his legs up a little bit in the first. That's what Paul does best. He's, a, he's one of the best leg kickers in the game. And uh, if you let him get two or three kicks on you, he, you just can't check him. Your leg's too banged up. So he, he, uh, yeah, he did a good job. He's too good for me. Now, I do want to ask you, what's the plans for 2000? Nine. Is that rest up and go back to 2010? And uh, would you like a rematch with the Sting Paul Slowinski as well uh, in possibly early 2010? Yeah, for sure, man. Well, I mean, Paul, Paul's the best guy in the country. I've probably got a few fights I've got to get under my belt before I deserve to fight him again. But yeah, definitely down the track. That's something I look at for sure. All right, ladies and gentlemen, once again, Ben the Governor Edwards. Takes a lot of heart and courage to step into this ring. And ladies and gentlemen, your new IK Super Heavyweight Champion, the Sting, Paul Slowinski. Congratulations, Paul. Yeah, thanks everyone. i just like to say, I, I've, I've been doing this a little bit longer than Ben has. I understand where he comes from because I have had few good wins and um, I've took um, on a bigger fish that I fought and I also lost. So, um, both bands got a good record, but I think you gotta learn to walk before you run. No disrespect, you need a few more fights. Um, yeah, thanks for the fight. Um, thanks, thank you, uh, Melbourne. Thank Nadja, Nugget, Josh. Thanks, uh, my friends, my missus, my corner. Everyone, thank you for having me. I'm back in Australia. I'll be here this year, maybe next year. So I'd like to get as many fights as I can. And I'll uh, see you soon. Bye. Well, there you have it, folks. What a night of action. Evolution 18 Melbourne was everything we hoped for. And a whole lot more devastating, crunching late kicks to cap off at the great night of action. Have well, it was uh, the basics yet again that did it for the sting. Just chopped away at uh, Ben Edwards' legs. Well, we've seen the result of what good leg kicking can do. And uh, congratulations, Paul Slowinski, International Kickboxer Magazine, second champion, first ever super heavyweight champion. And uh, what, a, what a way to win it. Well, folks, there you have it from the State Hockey and Netball Centre in Melbourne, the voice, Michael Chanello, the former Australian champion, Mark the Hammond Castanini brother. Been a pleasure as always. And, folks, we'll see you next time. Keep it tuned to Fox Sports from us. Good night.